टॉपिक इज द शिवालिक रेंज शिवालिक रेंज साउथ ऑफ द हिमांचल ऑलरेडी यू नो द नदन पार्ट द हिमाद्री और इनर हिमालय और ग्रेटर हिमालय देन साउथ ऑफ हिमाद्री इट्स द हिमांचल और लेजर हिमालय एंड साउथ ऑफ द हिमांचल इट्स द शिवालिक रेंज एंड इट्स द आउटर मोस्ट रेंज ऑफ द हिमालय विद द हाइट इट इज वेरी डिफरेंट प्लेसेस द हाइट इट इज डिफरेंट एंड इट्स वेरी बिटवीन नाइन हंड्रेड टू इलेवन हंड्रेड मीटर एंड द एवरेज वेथ ऑफ द शिवालिक इज टेन टू फिफ्टी किलोमीटर एज सम प्लेसेस इट इज फिफ्टी और सम प्लेसेस इट इज टेन किलोमीटर and this shivalik range composed of the coarse sediments as the river carries the silt or sediments it also deposit in some part of shivalik range these valleys are covered with the thick gravel and alluvium as the himalayan rivers carries the stones pebbles it deposit in the shivalik range so the longitudinal valleys are also form in the shivalik range the longitudinal valleys between the laser himalaya and shivalik range where the stones or pebbles it is deposited and these forms as a pebbles type of the plain land which is called the dunes in the desert area it is the sand area which is called dunes but it is not the dunes it's the stone pebbles the plain, plain area but on the altitude high higher hills or the mountains as dehra dun it is where in the shivalik range dehra dun already you know where it's the capital of uttarakhand dehra dun kotli dun or patli dun is also the part of the shivalik range it's the division of himalaya the next division of himalaya it is the regional division of himalaya and already we have discussed about the division of himalaya from north to south now we have to understand the division of himalaya from west to east and these demarcation of himalaya this division of himalaya from west to east demarcated by the rivers demarcated by the indus river satluj river kali river tista river and dihang rivers it's demarcated so firstly we have to know the punjab himalaya punjab himalaya west of the himalaya here the punjab himalaya punjab plain already but the himalayan part is also known as the punjab himalaya and this lying between the indus and satluj river and has been traditionally known as the punjab himalaya it also known as the kashmir himalaya because it's lying in the kashmir region and the next one is also it is known as the himanchal himalaya locally because here the kashmir here the himanchal and here it is the punjab and it is from west to east the another part of the himalayan from west to east lying between satluj to the kali river and this rivers it's demarcated and the part of the himalaya it is known as the kumau himalaya then after from kali to the tista river here the kali to the tista river this part here do you know which place it is it is the nepal and this himalaya is also known as the nepal himalaya then the part lying between tista and dihang river tista and dihang river this himalaya is known as the assam himalaya assam plain it is another area but the himalaya part is known as the assam himalaya so and about this the punjab himalaya then this 
also known as the Kashmir Himalaya, Himanchal Himalaya and then it is lying between Indus and Satlaj. Then the Satlaj and Kali, it is the Kumau Himalaya, then Kali to Tista, Nepal Himalaya, Tista to Dihang, it's the Assam Himalaya. And the, these Himalaya, it is known as the Purvanchal Himalaya. Here the Brahmaputra River and it's the eastern part of our country. These are beyond the Dihang River. Dihang River, it forms the gorge here and the ranges turns the south. Northeastern boundary here, the northeastern boundary. And these Purvanchal hills are composed of strong sandstones which are sedimentary rocks covered with the dense forest and mostly run as the parallel ranges and valleys. Here the Purvanchal included which the Naga Hills, Patkai Hills, Mizo Hills, Garo, Khasi, Jentia Hills and all these are known as the Purvanchal Hills. Now your homework to learn and write about the division of Himalaya north to south division of Himalaya and west to east division of Himalaya and then you have to write about the Purvanchal Hills along with the map. So thank you for watching video.